uh, New Ventures BC offers a very powerful exercise for technology entrepreneurs by allowing them to really work through their business models, searching for product market fit, and taking advantage of the skills of, on of entrepreneurs, serial entrepreneurs and mentors in the process. The idea of the competition is to give them the education tools and also people that have, have been there, done that, who have experience and can take a look at something that might be new to you and give you some really seasoned insight. I think that the level of sophistication of entrepreneurs in BC has gone up and during that time and I think New Ventures has had a lot to do with it. It's been a phenomenal impact just from the point of view of creating this annual momentum of technology companies looking forward to competing for the top prize. The competition has generated over 3,100 jobs for British Columbians. It's raised over $140 million in investment financing. This year's finalists are, are I, I would say, uh, probably the most sophisticated group of startup entrepreneurs I've seen in this competition over all of the years. From top to bottom, just outstanding. My name is Bruce Townsend, I'm the CEO at Ecotagus. Ecotagus helps utilities meet their conservation targets, and we do it through smart meter data analytics. My name is John Carter, and I'm with Bonigo, and we offer a total e-commerce solution for service-based companies that meet their clients on site. My name is Peter Halschman, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of Black Home Design Automation. We build software and IP for the semiconductor industry to reduce their manufacturing costs and to accelerate time to market. Uh, I'm Carl Hansen, I'm CEO of Epsilera. Uh, Epsilera is a spin-out company from my lab at UBC, so I'm actually an associate professor, and we've developed a technology for the, the discovery of a class of drugs called antibodies. My name is Mandy Chan, and I'm the founder and CEO of Vidigami. Vidigami is a private photo sharing website that we've designed exclusively for schools. It allows the parents, teachers, and kids to all upload photos and memories of their school year into a private and secure environment. My name is Ola Kowalewski and I am CEO and co-founder of Medinovel. Medinovel is a medical innovation company developing the product One Step Prep, which is a sterile mitt used for disinfecting patient skin before surgery. Hey, my name is Chris Preed. I'm the founder and CEO of Two Hat Security. Now, we are a security company that provides safety features for kids. We're working with uh, games, virtual worlds for kids, and we're doing chat filtering technology. My name is Mariam. I am CEO and co-founder of Mosco. Mosco provides professional imaging device to empower patients for early skin cancer diagnosis. It also provides efficient patient management solution for healthcare providers and hospitals. I'm Bob Axadbury, I'm a CEO and co-founder at Scoop. Scoop is a mobile collaboration platform for industrial users and it improves um, issue resolution, speed, safety, quality and responsiveness. Uh, my name is Michael Ferguson and I'm the Vice President of R&D at SmartPager. My name is Ben Moore, I'm the CEO at SmartPager. SmartPager is a cloud-based platform which saves doctors and practices and hospitals time and money by fixing issues with communications. A good pitch is, is simple. It also has to be clear and concise. Jarring a little. You need to believe in your product. Yeah, I think it's about communication. It's about telling your story in a correct way. And entertains. So we had the benefit of having three mentors this year, and they were very helpful because each one of them are successful, experienced entrepreneurs. Uh, we had mentors from all walks of life and different professions, so the diversity of the advice offered was really helpful for us, and they were fantastic. They spent a lot of time with us over the phone, listening to our pitch. They're really keen to help, and it's, uh, it's hard to get someone really excited about your product. And I really look forward to working with them closely in, in, in other capacities moving forward. New Ventures BC helped us by providing us with a forum to be able to share what we do with a group of very experienced entrepreneurs and their feedback was hugely valuable. So I think New Ventures BC has really allowed us to focus uh, our thinking on how our business operates. It basically brought us out of a bit of a closed box where we were thinking too much about our technology and not enough yet about the pitch, the story of our product. It was a great uh, motivation, uh, really was sort of a whip to get you to develop your, your business model and, and think about how to make money on this as well. Having something that's a framework to kind of learn on was priceless. It was, yeah, it was perfect for me. I had to think through what is it actually we're going to be doing, why do we exist, 
what, what difference we're going to make and how we're going to get there. Success, I think, is to learn how to do things right. To learn from people who have done this, who have gone through the, this path before. And we saw the New Ventures BC competition as a way to validate our business and to help give us some exposure. Having come this far to the top ten itself has been an accomplishment for us and we're very proud of that. The one piece of advice I would give to people participating next year is to simplify your pitch so that you can get it across in a very short period of time. I'd like to thank my mentors, uh, Rob Perth, Ed Levinson, and Garland Schratt. Jim Derbyshire, Brad Quinton, Bill Northcott, and Richard Wong. And Andrew Booth, Cheng Han, Judy, and Julia. Hugh, Joseph, Ian, and Pilsen. Angela Lake, Dom Linder, Kevin Semi, and Aziz Parani. A special thanks to Ian Reed, Ben Pickering, and Frank LeFleur. James Wells, uh, Jim McBeth, Ian Ball, and Adam Wilkins. York, David, Adam, and Vaslav. Well, Simon, Victor, and Julian, you guys have been fantastic. So all I can say is to the top 10, it's been a pleasure meeting all of you and 